Hello and welcome to the Kaizen Project. I am the Kaizen Man. Today's video is about how you can do a luxurious wet shave in the comfort of your own home. Now, the reason that I'm making this video is if you want to get that baby soft, smooth shave, you have to go to the barber. But when you go to the barber, there's a lineup and oftentimes you have to wait. And even when your turn comes, the barber is texting, he's taking phone calls or he's talking to other buddies. And before you know it, two hours have gone by. And that's just not a smart way to spend your time. So I decided to learn how to shave with a single blade and I do the wet shave at home. The second reason why I do a wet shave is, you know, I'm sure you guys, when you first started shaving, it was exciting and you were looking forward to shaving. But now that maybe you've been doing it for a little while, it's not as much fun. If you are sick and tired of shaving and you don't want to grow up a beard, which I know is quite popular these days. I've had a beard myself for a long time, but I've decided to go back to having a clean shaven face and doing the wet shave regularly. And having a closed shave is just another benefit because it helps me to look clean shaven for longer. I'm gonna walk you through my ritual here and I just wanna let you know right now that I'm not being sponsored by any of the products here. I'm doing this video just to share with you my shaving ritual. So the first thing that I do is I take the razor and I put the blade in it and I take my brush and I put them into hot water. I let the bristles of the brush warm up. I let the metal of the blade get nice and warm so when it touches my skin, it's already warmed up. The second thing that I do is I rinse my face with hot water for about a minute, two minutes, just so that my pores of my skin can open up. The beard can get a little bit softer so it's easier to shave. Once I've rinsed my face, then I start, then I go ahead and lather up the brush. I rub it into the soap dish and I start to create foam on my face. Uh, I do this for about a minute just to get a nice thick foam. Once I have that, I go ahead and start to shave. And I shave in the direction of the hair growth to start off. And then as I've cleaned up my face, if I want to go a little bit closer, I can go sideways or go against the hair growth if I want a really, really close shave. But I don't always do that and I don't recommend it either because it does irritate your skin and can also lead to hair growth getting thicker and stronger. And once I'm done with the shave, I rinse out the razor, I, I take the blade off, I wipe it, I wipe everything with a cloth, make sure everything is nice and dry before I put it back to use next time. And the reason why I take care of my equipment here is because when you buy a single blade razor and you buy the brush, these things are gonna last me a lifetime. I never have to go and buy another razor again. So I definitely have an initial investment and if I save it, then I never have to buy another razor again, like you have to with those five blade razors and you have to buy the cartridges over and over again. And after the first shave, they don't work anymore. So just to go through that, the benefits of having a wet shave is I save time from going to the barber and I can use that time at home and I can listen to podcasts while I'm shaving, which also gives me an added benefit. I get a closer, better shave from doing wet shaving and I also save money because I don't have to constantly keep buying the cartridges for my razor. If you enjoyed that video, make sure you hit that like button, leave a comment. I love to hear from you and I've been getting some awesome feedback from you guys. So thank you so much for that. And thank you for watching. I really appreciate it. Till next time, it's the Kaizen Man.